All right. And I'm back with more Tales of Arise. I took the game's hint and saved and healed and whatever. So let's just go. So the vermin scum you call kin stirred up enough trouble for you two rats to make it all the way to me, huh? <laughs> what a pain in the ass. Although, it was pretty impressive of you to deliver it straight into my hands, the Master Core. You really think we're here to hand it over? <laughs> Why, of course not. You see, I'll be taking it back no matter what you say. <laughs> Ooh. In any case, oh this is the end for you. You won't be getting out of here alive. <laughs> oh, hello. The two of you were fools for coming here. Now die! A common thief will leave Sheik and you serve me? Don't make me laugh! You can keep your accursed crown! We're here to overthrow you and free the dead! Spare me your weeping, slave! Let the marksman handle this! You're mine! Uh, here's a healing arc! Take it. First aid! Die. Think again! Take it. Uh, You're mine! Yeah. Think again! Sight it! It's no over! Escape. The uh, plan is to try and get some perfect evades while I got a chance. So we got him halfway. Alfred. 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 
Yay, he has a face! Oh no. What are you? What the fuck? What the hell is that? Wow. It's manifested astral energy. Not only that, it's alive. Astral energy? From the spirit vessel? But wait, that was harvested for me. And that energy is supposed to be mine. the two of you. I knew it all along. And you'll pay! <laughs> Metal slave! Look what you did! Without your spirit vessel, or your master core, you're nothing. Shia, watch out! There! Uh, take it dead! Now, swallow blade! That thing's huge! Don't let it trap you in its flames! There. Take it! I'm Come only on. getting started! Uh. So yeah, just focus on ball stuff. Watch out! We need to stop him! Psych! 
Just worry about yourself. You're finished. Got him. This ends now. Consider yourself finished. There we go. That wasn't so bad. But why? Do you not possess the blood of a Renan? Why then would you turn against your own kind? It's always been the way of the Renan for the strongest to survive. And yet, you have allied yourself with a filthy Janet. You traitor! <laughs> Tell me why. Why bring ruin and devastation to your own kind? Things like you should die! Oh! <laughs> well, he's totally dead. The question is, are we? A monster made up of astral energy? How do we even... If this sword is made of astral energy as well, maybe... Is this going to absorb it? You gonna kill it? Now I gotta blow up the wall. Jesus. Might as well watch this again while we get a chance.
Yay, we get to see the opening again. Hooray! Oh. And I get it. I get an achievement. Woo! Flames. I see. Flames. My name is Alfin. Where am I? What happened? The rage <coughs> in me, fueling the sword. Where did it come from? This twisting fear that clings to me, holding me in check. The melancholic voice calling out to me. Who am I? Who was I? This is... Wakey-wakey, sunshine. About time, too. <laughs> A week? You mean that whole time I was... Out cold? Yeah. Just as well, too. When you blacked out, you were on your way to becoming a pile of ash. <sighs> Shion's the reason you're still here. Shion? You've healed me? In case you'd forgotten, we've still got four lords to defeat. You dying would have only slowed things down. <coughs> Gee, thanks. What about Balsef's troops? We've got them on the ropes. While well, you've been getting your beauty sleep, most of the remaining Renans have either surrendered or fled. You slaying Balsef was the catalyst we'd been waiting for. Thanks to you, Galagli is finally free. You have my gratitude. We couldn't have done it without you. I just did what anyone would have done. Iron Matt, forgive me, Alfin. It's good to finally see who I'm speaking to. <sighs> Half of him, anyway. So, feel like telling us who you used to be? I. I wish I could. Memory's still giving you grief, eh? I see. Still, no sense in beating yourself up. You've remembered your name. The rest will come in time. So, what happens now? Well, just everything. The realm may be liberated, but we're still destitute. You name it, anything and everything starts from scratch. But enough of that. You've just woken up. You should get a sense of the scale of what you've accomplished. Head over to the Gates of Fire and take a look at the view. It's a sight too many Danans died only ever seeing in their dreams. The Gates of Fire. I'll be your chaperone. Last thing we need is you tripping on a pebble and missing another week. Remind me to laugh next time. That should be useful. I'll keep that stuff in mind. Somebody's watching us. Maybe there's someone around here who needs our help. Yeah, yeah, shut up. <laughs> this is. Yeah. Hmm? What? <laughs> uh -huh. There we go. Neato. Shion. Why do you keep people at arm's length? You're always trying to wave it off whenever someone's nice to you. 
Like with Tilsa just now. Why couldn't you just accept her gratitude? Our interests just happen to overlap. I don't want people thinking I'm doing things to be nice when in reality they benefit both of us. All I care about is that we hurry up and defeat the Lords. See? That's what I mean. <laughs> you want to defeat the Lords. I may have been skeptical at first, but now I really believe you meant it. Yet despite that, you still took the time to help out those injured Danans, didn't you? I did it because it was necessary and I got roped into helping out. Is that the same reason you helped that kid in Balsif's castle? Because it sure didn't look that way to me. <sighs> You've helped me too. Not just with my injuries, but by being there for me as well. Even though I can't feel pain, the injuries I get from using the Blazing Sword could probably kill me. That thought alone should be terrifying. But I know you'll always be there by my side, ready to heal me. It's because of you that I can wield the Blazing Sword. like that <laughs> if you get any closer you're going to set off my thorns you know uh, I was just trying to compliment you you were <laughs> what now uh oh Sion, your thorns it's okay I'll stop talking about it. <laughs> you... you will? In any case, I'm just glad that you're the one who ended up with the Master Core. Thank you, Xion, for everything. <sighs> <laughs> now let's go check out those gates of fire. Really, I swear. You're bad for the heart. <laughs> that blazing sword's turned out to be even stronger than I expected. <clears throat> With that much sheer power, elemental types are hardly a concern anymore. You can bring practically any foe down to their knees in a flash. Don't count on me being able to pull off another Gates of Fire. That only happened because I had the help of that Spirit Vessel monster, too. Still, you did defeat Balsif with it, which means it can also take down the other Lords. That's enough for me. Besides, if it was any stronger, your body wouldn't be able to handle it. Have you forgotten what happened after we finished off Balsif? No. But aren't you scared of having that much power inside of you? Even a little? Why would I be? Power provides opportunity. You don't expect me to simply throw it away, do you? No, I get it. It's a good ace to have up our sleeve, that's for sure. I'll make the most of it. Well, as much as I can without becoming charcoal. <laughs> All right. So we took down Balsaf. Yay! <clears throat> and that means that's a good enough place to stop and i'll call it a day thanks for watching